Hi, welcome to today's edition of Take 5. We're proud to be part of the Music Ministries here at St. Stephen's Episcopal in Wimberley, Texas. Joined today by our Youth and Families Minister, Elisa Webster, to give us a recap of God's Garden, the week of God's Garden, and what all went on and how it went, and, and tell us a little bit about what you, what you had. Well, we really had a wonderful week. It started off with rain. <laughs> Figures. <laughs> but we managed to do all our inside activities, including our recreation. And we had a lovely group of kids. They were a mixture of the church Sunday school kids and the kids from the school, St. Stephen's School. So that was lovely. Good. And we had great helpers. We had Nancy Henson and um, Becky Denton helping the kids with the activities as well, well as Donna Hoyland, who's our, nursery, our Sunday school teacher, and Melissa O'Dell, and myself. And then, of course, Jane Marburg, who um, led our recreation, which was awesome. We were in this garden doing treasure hunts. We were learning to dance. We were singing a lot. We had lots of mission stories. We um, made bottles of water for um, people who don't have fresh water. And that was one of the aims of the program, is to show the kids that there are other people that don't have enough food, that don't have clean water, that don't have houses, don't have warmth. So they made little quilts and bottled water, and well, the water was bottled, we just wrote on it um, that whoever got it would enjoy it. Mm -hmm. And um, so that was taken to the crisis bread basket and we made maracas so we could make noise to God and we had all our Bible stories. So all in all, it was a wonderful week and the first time we have done something like this here at St. Stephen's in a long time. We're planning for bigger and better next year. Cool. And hopefully, well, the girls, the older girls love the dancing, so they are our main dancers. And uh, some of the little ones were like, oh, I don't want to do it, and, but that's okay. <laughs> so we have a little bit of the dance that we learned, which is um, Jerusalem. Um, and we're hoping that you all watching will realize that our ki kids are the key to our future and they're the key to getting into the promised land. They are... Not that we become childish, but childlike in our trust and love of God. And the kids were really trusting and obedient. And that is, that is a shout out to their parents and their guardians and their grandparents who show them so much love and care when they're not at school and not at Sunday school. So I think it was a wonderful experience. We all enjoyed it. We were exhausted. Even the kids were exhausted. Amen. Um, <laughs> yes. And so we're looking forward to that and we're looking forward to the Sunday school opening so that those kids can come back and join us on a weekly basis. Cool, that all sounds great. We have a little bit of a clip from what all went on the last day, that Friday of the week. Uh, we hope you enjoy it.
And that is today's edition of Take 5. We're so glad you joined us. Our videos are posted to YouTube and Facebook every Thursday at 10 a.m. Central. We hope to see you soon. Goodbye. Have a great week.